Did you know, Khoisan languages spoken by the indigenous people of Southern Africa are famous for their click sounds? These fascinating languages are a symphony of unique consonants, a feature that sets them apart from most others. The Khoisan people, who have been using these intricate click sounds for centuries, have created a rich linguistic tapestry that's as diverse as it is unique. So next time you're trying to learn a new language, why not try one that's full of clicks? Imagine communicating every day with a language full of clicks. Now how do Khoisan languages compare with other language families? Let's take a fascinating linguistic journey, shall we? When we talk about language families, we're discussing groups of languages that share a common ancestor. For instance, the Indo-European language family includes English, German, Spanish, and Hindi, among others. On the other side of the world, the Sino-Tibetan family encompasses languages like Mandarin and Tibetan. But where does Khoisan fit in? Khoisan languages, native to Southern Africa, are truly unique. They're often recognized for their extensive use of click consonants, a phonetic feature rarely found in other language families. These languages have up to five different types of clicks, each with a distinct sound. Imagine a language where a click of the tongue can change the whole meaning of a sentence. But the uniqueness of Khoisan languages doesn't stop at phonetics. When it comes to grammar, these languages also stand apart. Unlike Indo-European languages which often rely on word order to convey meaning, Khoisan languages use an extensive system of prefixes and suffixes to indicate tense, mood, and aspect. This makes for a language that's incredibly flexible and expressive. Now, let's talk vocabulary. Khoisan languages have a rich and varied lexicon with words often carrying multiple meanings depending on context. This differs significantly from Sino-Tibetan languages, which tend to have more straightforward single-meaning words. So, are Khoisan languages related to any other language families? The answer is, we don't quite know. Some linguists propose that Khoisan languages might be the remnants of a much larger language family that once spanned across Africa. But as of now, this remains a hypothesis. What's certain though is that Khoisan languages offer a unique perspective on how humans can utilize sounds and structures to communicate. They remind us that language is not a static entity but rather a vibrant, ever-evolving tool for expression. So, Khoisan languages certainly stand apart in the world of languages. But did you know, the classification of Khoisan languages is a mystery? This might come as a surprise but the classification of Khoisan languages has been a topic of heated debate among linguists for decades. At the heart of this discourse is a hypothesis that suggests Khoisan languages may not form a single language family, but could be a collection of several unrelated languages. This perspective challenges the traditional view that all Khoisan languages share a common ancestor, a belief that has been widely accepted for many years. The Khoisan languages, spoken by the indigenous Khoi and San people of Southern Africa, are renowned for their complex click consonants and rich phonetic diversity. They are unlike any other languages in the world, which has led some linguists to categorize them as a unique language family. However, this classification is not without controversy. Some linguists argue that the similarities between Khoisan languages are superficial at best and do not necessarily indicate a shared ancestry. They believe that these similarities could be the result of language contact and convergence rather than common descent. This hypothesis is further supported by the fact that Khoisan languages exhibit significant variation in their grammatical structures and vocabulary, more than what is typically observed among languages of the same family. For instance, the Ju and Kung languages, both classified as Khoisan, have vastly different word orders, a feature that is usually consistent within a language family. In addition, recent genetic studies have revealed that the Khoi and San peoples are not a single homogenous group, but consist of several distinct populations. This genetic diversity could potentially mirror the linguistic diversity among the Khoisan languages, supporting the hypothesis of multiple unrelated languages. This debate highlights the complexity and diversity of human languages. It reminds us that language classification is not a straightforward process but a challenging task that requires careful analysis and open-mindedness. Yes, Khoisan languages might not be a language family at all. This revelation could change our understanding of the linguistic landscape of Southern Africa and indeed the world. But for now, the mystery of Khoisan languages continues to intrigue and puzzle linguists around the globe. What do you think about this hypothesis? It's a question that invites inquiry and stimulates the curiosity that's inherent in all of us. Now let's take a moment to consider the hypothesis of Khoisan languages. This hypothesis isn't just a casual thought or a fleeting idea. It's a proposition that's backed by years of linguistic research and analysis. 
But like any scientific hypothesis, it's not about accepting it blindly. It's about critically examining the evidence and questioning the assumptions. So, let's delve into it. Think about the linguistic similarities and differences that we've discussed earlier. Do they convincingly point towards a single language family? Or do they suggest a collection of unrelated languages? And what about the geographic distribution of these languages? Does it support the hypothesis? Or does it raise more questions? Consider also the implications of this hypothesis. If the Khoisan languages are indeed a single family, it would mean that they share a common ancestry. This could potentially shed light on the ancient migrations and cultural exchanges in Africa. On the other hand, if they are unrelated languages, it would mean that these languages developed independently. This could offer insights into the diverse linguistic evolution in the continent. And let's not forget about the practical implications. The classification of these languages could influence language preservation efforts, educational policies, and even social and political dynamics. It's a matter that goes beyond the realm of academia and touches the lives of the Khoisan-speaking communities. But remember, there's no right or wrong answer here. It's about thinking, questioning, and learning. It's about appreciating the complexity and diversity of languages. It's about understanding our shared human heritage. So, as we continue to explore the fascinating world of Khoisan languages, let's keep our minds open and our curiosity alive. Let's keep asking questions and seeking answers. Are Khoisan languages a single family or are they unrelated languages? What do you think? Regardless of the hypothesis, Khoisan languages hold immense value. These languages, often characterized by their unique click consonants, have a rich linguistic significance that extends beyond their distinct phonetics. They present a complex grammar structure and a wide array of sounds that challenge and broaden our understanding of what human languages can encompass. Studying Khoisan languages therefore equips linguists with a broader perspective, helping them appreciate the expansive and diverse nature of human language. But the importance of Khoisan languages isn't confined to the linguistic realm alone. They also hold a wealth of cultural significance. Each language acts as a vessel, carrying within it the traditions, customs, beliefs, and the collective wisdom of the Khoisan people. By studying these languages we can gain access to a rich and vibrant culture that has thrived for centuries, offering us a glimpse into their unique way of life, their relationship with nature, and their profound respect for their ancestry. In addition, Khoisan languages are a significant historical artifact. They are believed to be among the oldest languages in the world, potentially dating back tens of thousands of years. They offer linguists and historians a window into the past, providing clues about the early migration patterns of humans, the evolution of languages, and the development of human societies. When we study Khoisan languages, we are not just studying a set of words and grammar rules. We are delving into a rich tapestry of human history, culture, and diversity. We are unlocking stories of resilience, adaptation, and ingenuity that have been woven into these languages over countless generations. In a world where languages are rapidly dying out, the preservation and study of Khoisan languages are more important than ever. They remind us of the immense diversity of human experiences and the remarkable adaptability of human language. Indeed, Khoisan languages offer a fascinating glimpse into the rich tapestry of human languages. So, that's a quick dive into the world of Khoisan languages. We've journeyed together through the fascinating complexities of this linguistic family, contrasting it against other language families, and delving into its intriguing mysteries. Indeed, the Khoisan languages with their unique click consonants and rich cultural heritage offer us a glimpse into an often overlooked chapter of human history. We've also discussed the importance of Khoisan languages, not just as a means of communication, but as a vital link to our shared past. These languages, which have survived and evolved over thousands of years, are a testament to the resilience and adaptability of human cultures. The study and preservation of Khoisan languages can provide valuable insights into our collective story, shedding light on how our ancestors lived, thought, and interacted with the world around them. But our journey doesn't have to end here. There's so much more to learn and discover about the Khoisan languages and the cultures they represent, so why not dive a little deeper? Find out more about the Khoisan people, their history and their languages, and don't forget to share your thoughts and discoveries in the comments section. Remember every language, whether it's Khoisan or not, tells a unique story about human history and culture. So keep exploring, keep learning, and stay curious. 
Before we wrap up, if you found this video enlightening and want to continue this journey of discovery, don't forget to hit the like button. Please subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell as so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. Your support helps us continue to spread knowledge about Africa.